Hi guys, welcome. It has been, oh my lanta, three months since the last time I posted a video and little did I know within the three months that my video would actually get any sort of attention and I cannot believe there's people out there who actually subscribed and actually made comments on asking when is the next episode and so coming back to it and you know seeing your everyone's comments even on YouTube off YouTube it really honestly motivated me to come back and start reading again and so today we will be reading uh, episode 7, 8, and 9. I will pretty much pre-re-record um, the future chapters so you guys are gonna see me wearing the same outfit in some of the videos so I am so sorry but hey thank you so much for supporting me and loving me and always motivating me to be better and do better and continue uploading content. So, all right, let's get started. All right, here we go. Do you think the bird will come visit again? <laughs> I do hope it returns and with another letter. <laughs> I should think it will be back as long as it doesn't lose its way. Ah, oh, my heart is a flutter from the excitement. I wonder whose bird it is. Click. Creak. <gasps> Ugh, it's him. Your Majesty. Ah, you finally returned, Empress. What brings you here? I believe Rashta will need her very own lady in waiting. Oh. But finding a willing noble has been difficult, and I've been having such a pleasant day. It's obvious they're all being cautious because you haven't joined in on the search. So, I want you to lead the search in finding Rasha, her lady-in-waiting. My chest feels strangely heavy. Very well. Good. I'm counting on you. Clack. Your Majesty, you must must you be real be the one to find the woman's wait, lady in waiting? Why? I heard even His Majesty's secretaries have given up. <sighs> Honestly, I don't want to. Why must the Empress personally find a lady in waiting for a mere mistress? Oh my aching head, my word. But. With how insistent he was, ladies in waiting are chosen from nobles of the same rank or at most a rung or two lower. But Rashta is not from a noble family, so it is a breach of etiquette to ask a noble woman to take on this role. This will be difficult. What could I do but agree? Please send invitations to the noble women and their daughters for a tea party. The remarried empress. Here we go. Huh? The pancakes looks delicious. Oh, and there's cupcake and flan. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> Thank you for the invitation. It's been a while since we've met, and you are as beautiful as always, your majesty. Agreed, and to what do we owe the pleasure of your invitation to this ma magnificent tea party? You are all much too kind. I've invited you all here because I need your help. <gasps> oh my, our help? Anything for you, your majesty. If it's for you, of course we'll help. His Majesty is searching for a lady-in-waiting to attend to his soon-to-be mistress. Nobles take great pride in their status in society. So I mustn't mention her birth. Would any of you be willing to become her lady-in-waiting? <sighs> Silence. <gasps> Why do they all look so uncomfortable? Um... Do you mean Lady Rashta? To be honest, she's all er anyone's been talking about lately. 
her and her status as a runaway slave. I'd find it difficult enough to agree to become a commoner's lady-in-waiting, let alone a runaway slave. I'll die of embarrassment if I had to become a runaway slave's lady-in-waiting. <gasps> I'm so tired. <laughs> Shall I prepare a bath for you to, so you can relax? Huh? <gasps> the bird! Or would you prefer going on a walk? Perhaps we can meet the bird we saw last time? Oh? It's really come back? What? The bird is really here! The bird? It must be here to see you, your majesty. It even has a letter tied to its leg. <gasps> oh my. I'd like to think I'm a bit more intelligent than a bird. I've woken up from my dragon stupor now. <laughs> Laura, give me a pen and paper, will you? It seems as if you haven't awoken completely. What is the bird's name? <gasps> it's fun for you too, isn't it, your majesty? <laughs> hmm, a bit. <laughs> Here. Make sure not to lose your way this time too. <laughs> the bird is shook. <gasps> Come visit again. Will I get another letter? I hope I do. Your Majesty, the Emperor is here. Again. Good day, Your Majesty. You're visiting often lately, Your Majesty. What brings you here today? How goes the search for Rasha's lady-in-waiting? Again with this Rashta girl. I invited and asked all the noble women and their daughters, but none of would step forth. Is that all? <laughs> Pardon? There must be a reason why they declined. Did you perhaps spout some nonsense to them? That is so freaking rude. Um, excuse me, it's not our fault that you're dating a freaking trash. Just kidding. Continu continuing on spout some nonsense to them I feel it girl how could I when I know nothing about her people can still talk even if they know nothing you're right just as there are people who suspect others without reason why don't I rephrase that are you the one who spread the rumors about Rasha being a runaway slave? To be continued. Next chapter. No matter how much I think about it, there's no one who would benefit more from such a rumor than you. Rasha is your love rival after all. The thorns are wrapping around her. Love rival? Your mistress is not my love rival. You are not my love, so how could she be my love rival? That is a slap in the face, bro. What goes on between you and your mistress is none of my concern. It tires me to even think about it. <sighs> so don't drag me into this anymore. <sighs> oh, oh, that cold breeze he thought he thought she is crazy about him <laughs> move on get rid of the trash <sighs> an empress isn't supposed to cry about something like this she's so cute though when she's sad <sighs> so good at finding me another letter okay is such a thing needed you may name it if you like <laughs> what an indifferent master hmm. Hmm? it's so cute 
Oh, did you notice that I've been crying? I'll let you in on a little secret. This is my secret place. I sometimes come here to cry all my feelings out. It's a secret, understand? Oh my, the bird petted her. Are you trying to comfort me? How kind are you are? <laughs> a kind, intelligent bird like you deserve a name, which befits your character. Queen. <laughs> the bird's name is Queen. So your name shall be Queen. <gasps> Squawk! <laughs> Thanks, thank you for coming to see me, Queen. I'm in good spirits now, thanks to you. <sighs> so cute. I hope you will come visit me again. Look at all those birds. <gasps> well, hello, hello. <laughs> Oh my Lanta, heavens above, above, how could she name a man queen? So he's the bird? Oh my Lanta, okay, okay, what was that? Oops, you said you go survey the premises, do you take another detour again? <sighs> No, of course not. I went to re -conitur? I can't say the word. Re to re -conitur. I can't say that. I'm so sorry, guys. The Imperial Palace. Did you really? You don't believe me? <sighs> it's not that I don't, but please do be careful. Please, please remember your position, your Imperial Highness. Henry. Alright, alright. First in line to the throne of the Western Kingdom, the Remarried Empress, Episode 8. My goodness. Huh? It's quite alright, the Empress never comes at this time of day. And it's not like she owns the entire West Palace. There's no reason you can't come here too, Lady Rashta. Your Majesty! Oh, oh no. <gasps> Oh, snap. Big sister, I mean, your majesty. That chair is mine. <gasps> oh, um, I, I... And that hang handkerchief you were lying on is also mine. I I'm sorry, your majesty. I didn't know. I just... Happened to come across this chair, so I... It's fine, since you didn't know, but you should refrain from coming to the West Palace. B but I want to become friends with you. You can become friends with the next mistress. The next mistress? Yes, the one His Majesty will take in an end after you. Your Majesty, the Emperor. Your Majesty, what brings you here at this hour? Why have you changed so much? What do you mean I've changed? I'm talking about what happened with Rasha. Again with Rasha. I'm sick and tired of hearing that name. I've already told you I didn't want to hear about her anymore, and yet you continue to bring her up. I heard what happened this afternoon. Your Majesty! You don't have- if you- you don't want to hear about her? If you had just let her be, I wouldn't be here in the first place. Your Majesty. Did your father also frequently bring up Countess Sophia to your mother? Suveshu's father's mistress. Rashtra is also one of your people. Don't you pity her? No. I don't realize I didn't realize you were capable of saying such horrid things. 
Your Majesty. Truly? His Majesty visited the Empress and angrily yelled at her? For me? He did. Apparently he shouted loudly enough for his voice to carry through the halls. And that's not all. He sent a chair especially for you. <gasps> oh. oh my, his majesty is so gallant. <laughs> <sighs> to be continued. Here we go, guys. Episode 9. Starry skies. <laughs> Squawk! Tweet, tweet. Huh? <gasps> Queen! You return more quickly this time. Queen? <gasps> uh, if I didn't know any better, I'll think that this was your room. <laughs> Did your master send you an, on an errand this late in the evening? As you wish, the bird's name shall be Queen. But you should bear in mind that it's a male. Oh, my. Were you a male bird? <laughs> it's so mad at her. Are you upset that I didn't know? Squawk! <laughs> the Remarried Empress. Episode 9. Last one. Before long, the New Year's ceremony was upon us. It was a relief that neither Suvishu or I had very many distinguished guests arriving. We could avoid seeing each other for a while if we didn't need to greet them. Unfortunately, I couldn't keep my distance forever. Make way for Prince Henry from the Western Kingdom. They're good at faking it, you know? Oof. Plunk. Prince Henry. He is the first in line to the throne of the Western Kingdom. And at the center of many rumors, such as those which describe he, his great cruelty or great beauty. Huh? Clank, clank, clank. I see that at least the rumor about his beauty was true. She is starstruck. With a face as handsome as his, rumors could swirl even if he stood in corner with his eye mouth shut. Pleased. Huh? He pulled her. <gasps> uh. Oh? It is an honor to meet you, my queen. Okay, okay. It is an honor to meet you as well, Prince Henry. I hope you get plenty of rest before the New Year's ceremony. Please enjoy your time at the palace. I'm sure it will be your to your liking. Look at that smirk. <laughs> it is already very much to my liking. What a flirt. Oh my gosh. And very beautiful as well. Smooth. Smooth. <laughs> Huh? Back so soon? <gasps> alright, alright. You want me you want me to quickly read it? Uh there's a fly in this house. I'm about to <laughs> about to stop everything and catch it. I arrived at the Imperial Palace. Can you guess who I am? <gasps> oh my. Your master has arrived. Huh? Hmm. I'm not sure who you are. Mm. Do you... Do you know who I am? Whoosh. Queen! <laughs> Shall we make a bet? The one who figure out, figures out who the other is first wins. A, a bet! The nerve of your master making you go out in this rain? Oh, she's drying up the bird. <laughs> what a wicked master you have. Sure. Strongly disagrees. 
Chip! Why are you shaking your head? It's clear that you do. Squawk! And what will be the prize? Still like the sparkly eyes. You want me to tie it on you? No. <laughs> it's raining outside. I'm different from your master. You shall sleep with me tonight. I'll let you leave once the rain lets up. Huh? Cheer! Rose it. <laughs> He's trying to leave. Oh my gosh, escaped. Huh? Queen? <gasps> Cheer! Queen, have you already made the trip? I wonder what your master wrote. Queen shall be the prize. Alright, you guys, that wraps up literally episode 7, 8, and 9. I will be continuing reading and I will upload the next episode literally maybe next week. <gasps> thank you so much, you guys, for tuning in and listening to me read. And thank you so much, you guys, for literally leaving comments and likes and subbing. Like, it means so much. I hope you guys have a wonderful night and feel free to check out my other videos. Bye! Banana bread? That sounds so good! When can we cook banana CK? Ooh. What do you mean you're gonna cook banana? And what do you mean banana bread? <laughs> the audacity of these people! I am not delicious! I am okay, you know. I'm, I, I'm actually, you know, I, I'm kind of molding a little bit, you know, but I'm not very tasty. You better back back, back back. They're trying to eat me.